Winona used to be known as the best kept secret along the Mississippi River, but not anymore. A variety of activities ranging from the arts to the outdoors have made our city a destination for many. Recently, Winona was named best day trip by City Pages. Visit Winona Executive Director Pat Mutter explains what draws visitors to Winona. I think for people uh, outside of the area, they are um, very happy to find out that we have so much to offer people as far as things to do, not just for a day, but overnight or for a few days. I think we have great arts and certainly our summer festivals have become very well known and, and very much appreciated. We get a lot of people who return for our annual events, especially the summer events. And then there's also great um, attractions that are year-round. So places like the Minnesota Marine Art Museum or the Winona County History Center, Polish Museum, Watkins Museum, Garvin Heights Vineyards, uh, those are some of the attractions. And certainly our downtown area, I think we have had so many new businesses or businesses that have moved to the downtown area that are very unique and, and offer um, great products that you may not be able to find elsewhere. And there's also just wonderful outdoor recreation. Uh, we as Visit Winona have started to put a focus on letting people know that the river offers great canoeing and kayaking and fishing and birding. And we have been working very closely with the city of Winona for uh, offerings at Lake Park Lodge and Lake Park Winona and with Winona State Outdoor Recreation, offering things like weekly rock climbing up Sugarloaf and also paddling in the backwaters. Um, we worked last year with the Upper Mississippi Wildlife and Fish Refuge and uh, DNR to do the first Minnesota Water Trails Day. So we are very blessed in Winona to have so many great things. We won the same award a few years ago and I think um, for City Pages, which started out as a monthly publication talking about local music scene, uh, certainly I think the rise of Midwest Music Fest has again brought the attention that uh, we have great arts and we have a great music scene and also the outdoors. So I think for people looking for things to do, whether it's during the day or during the evening or for a whole weekend, there are just so many options. And we are a very scenic uh, drive from the Twin Cities. Uh, as far as I know, they have a readership of about 70,000, and that's a lot of people. And uh, this was voted by the readers. So we are very um, proud and we're just very grateful to all the people who voted for Winona as the best day trip.